Hey man, they done got the 99 overall badge glitch in college football, man. We gonna go over how they doing it and why they doing it. I'm hearing a ultimate team glitch too. Also, more realistic gameplay coming to NBA 2K25. We have some very viral clips to go over and to um, explain and react to the 2K communities. Very impulsive, inaccurate, and knowledgeable. Before we get into all that, man, y'all make sure y'all like up the goddamn video. It's free. Subscribe. Turn on post notes. So look, as you can see, this is the method for the skill points glitch for College Football 25 Road to Glory. Thank me later. 1.7 million views, right? Now, my whole thing is, why are we doing this in an offline mode that you, you can't take the player online? Doesn't that defeat the whole purpose? I'm confused. Now, here is Gamer at k -Easy, or Keezy. He got millions of views posting it and he he's explaining it man i don't understand why people are glitching on an offline mode but let, let's hear what he got to say about it man for some reason a bunch of people are saying the 99 overall glitch isn't working anymore it's patched i just made this 5-5 five, five middle linebacker for no reason <laughs> just Damn. now just to prove it's still working literally just got 1.6 million xp on a brand new God, damn. three minutes and i think i found out why it wasn't working for some people so follow these new updated steps and you should be good damn. start off by making a brand new character the damn. type of recruit does not matter last time we did underdog but just to prove this works with any this time i'm choosing blue chip someone okay. in my comments said db wasn't working so let's choose cornerback archetype doesn't matter i'm gonna just choose okay a you're a better at all you could change this after you're 99. mental okay. ability doesn't matter choose any for your team it doesn't matter choose any i'm signing with holy toledo before you touch anything else go to league settings skill level heisman quarter length 15 minutes done Damn. now advance the week hit practice Go to How do y'all even be figuring this out? Pick the first team drew. Now, super important. Last time I said get at least a bronze. Do not go over bronze. Once you get before over the bronze, game even came out. Back. The only time this glitch didn't work for me is when I got this to silk. And once you get out of that match, you see I got 1.6 uh. million XP. Now, after that one drill, we have 127 skill points. After using all my skill points, my player only ended up being a 98. Because if you don't put the attributes in places that matter for your position. You can be a low overall. I did this so wrong and only was an 88. Now, I, I don't understand why I do that. Now, my whole thing is some people, they blame tubers and streamers for uh ruining video games and stuff, right? My whole thing is you should blame the internet more than uh YouTubers and guys. Even if no YouTuber posted, one of your people will post it and they will get the same amount of you. All a YouTuber's doing is capitalizing for the brand. It, it's already gonna be posted. So then when you really think about it and really understand everything, gotta go more towards the game. Like, why are you allowing this? Now I could understand if y'all was glitching for the VC, you know, of 2K to get them up to 99, of course, you know, it's completely different, but a offline mode, I don't see the point in that, man. I, I recommend y'all to not do it or you're not gonna uh, enjoy the game as much like i promise you y'all the internet the the communities they want to see stuff like this it's 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 them if all youtubers just cease to exist they would all be replaced by someone from the community and they would get the same type of views so you really gotta try to hold the uh game creators people that they don't know that college football just came out and i don't know how i did this but accidentally glitched my player to a 97 i'm not trying to exploit or cheat this was a mistake damn what what do y'all think they, uh they should do should they they just restart everything so i accidentally glitched my player in college football and now he's a 97 overall with hella skill points and i don't know what to do uh to prove it more i only have two games played it's 2024 just week three damn. i didn't simulate i have 127 skill points with only two games played and a 97 overall and I'm, I'm not even middle linebacker one um i don't know this happened at all um i'm obviously fun with this most definitely because i'm a 2k player i'm not trying to like i just bought this for fun i'm not gonna make content on it or anything but i literally have everything i can buy all this i can max this shit I, like i said i don't know how i did it i'm not trying to glitch i'm not trying to exploit the game or anything okay okay so look i posted a clip yesterday of nba 2k 15 and i'm trying to explain to people how the golden era 2ks were more realistic and realistic dribble moves could be used at the top level and really cook people so it's not just this left right l2 cancel meta that you see in these newer 2ks right it played a lot more realistic because realistic moves like the momentum crossover or this move that y'all about to see right here this stick move right here guys bang I'm not talking about the ankle breaker. I'm just talking about that behind the back. 
and then being able to move quickly, it made it to where you could peat with whatever type of cheeser, right? But in these newer 2Ks, stick moves are not effective. You try to kill people off of momentum crosses or try to do this, it's you not going nowhere, bro. You feel me? So it really makes people have more of a same play style than they would in previous 2Ks. That's all I'm saying, dog. Y'all saying someone, some people saying some people crying and uh, guys, I'm the best, okay? <laughs> I try to be a god in this game, bro. I can get on not playing for a month, be a hundred, drop 42 points in the wreck lot, okay? With randoms. Look, 2K Intel posted the clip that I posted. We're gonna react to what everybody's saying and we're gonna do an educational lesson for y'all. Now, now, Chalk says, RNG ankle breaker into the RNG while the center holds his nuts in the paint for the board. Bring it back. Now, Chalk back then was a little kid. You know, he was a boy of uh, creators back then. So he doesn't really understand. And when he played, he probably had a three win percent. So he don't understand the game, right? And he probably didn't see my tweet because I have him blocked because uh, he was telling me uh, 2K18 was better than all the uh, 2Ks before it. So I couldn't take it. But I'm not talking about the RNG angle. I'm just talking about the behind the back. I'm saying moves like this should be in the newer 2Ks so sim players can have more of a chance versus the meta players, right? It would be more fun for everyone. Now, then he's saying the RNG white. First of all, this shot timing would have been a green in today's age. What y'all don't realize, and it shows how much y'all understand the game or the past games or anything. What y'all don't realize is now 80% of whites just turned green. Now. They opened up the green one. There's even tests. 2K Lab verified after I said it. I been knew it. You could tell if you understood the 2Ks. The, the white, they just, they're not just going to give you the green all the time in the older 2Ks. Everyone knows the older 2Ks, it was hard to shoot it. 2K15 before patch four, it was a way harder shooting 2K than these newer 2Ks. I'm not shooting 75% from three like I'm doing in 2K24. These 2Ks were harder to shoot on, bro. Okay, just a fact. But um, yeah, like this and that, green or miss is just a visual thing, guys. Whites just turn green now, if y'all didn't know that. And then even sometimes when you time your shot correctly, you'll miss, but you can't tell anymore because no one uses the meter, guys. You can't tell things. Y'all know when sometimes you be timing it right, it makes you miss. So it's literally like the same. People, they don't they don't think about it like Yeah, this guy tells me what the difference. It's the same left, right, shit little smoother it's way smooth but literally similar if not the same moves as every formation gets a different name he doesn't the casual eye they can't really understand what they're looking at bro but i was talking about the behind the back okay and he's left right see you you could tell like most casuals anything left right everything curry slide but yeah y'all i'm capping bro just go to twitch and look at people play stage and you'll see what i'm talking about bro <laughs> or look up some stage vids or watch some comp pro-am people play. You'll, you'll see what I'm talking about, man. This is actual dribbling. Even old heads can't hate on this, you feel me? Look at all this positivity, man. These dribble animations are garbage for real. Now y'all know he didn't play the game, guys, right? And people be judging stuff instead of asking questions. Now y'all can find other clips of people really dribbling and really going crazy with it. Y'all shouldn't just judge it off of one clip. Cause y'all know if someone don't know how to really dribble or they're not showing a certain aspect, then you're not gonna really get to see everything. Mike, this is way more realistic than <laughs> the newer 2Ks. Like literally is literally built into the newer 2K. And now you can instant crab. Y'all remember in 2K23 that the damn Russell Westbrook instant, instant crab? That wasn't in the older 2Ks. I'm just saying, man, make that your base and everyone will have more fun. He thinks I'm engagement farming. He can't even grasp his head because he's been so brainwashed that everyone says these older 2Ks are way more arcade. It's not true. They were more realistic. Move like they ain't got weight on them. That, that's called fluid, my boy. Nobody's talking about the ankle breaker. Guys, we, we can see ankle breakers on any 2K. Talking about the behind the back and then shooting on a dime. That's realistic. You have a great player, you can shoot on a dime. That created way better gameplay, guys. You did not have to do none of that quick stop stuff. You could stop on a dime and shoot and not accidentally fade. You did not have to wait 
If you killed someone with a great dribble move, you could then be rewarded for being the better player in shooting. And defense was much more reactive and all that, right? It was just a way better, it was on a way better engine and gameplay in general. You ain't get no flunky animations and all this and that, just random animations because the latency or just random animations in general. It, it just played better, bro. I'm trying to tell y'all. If y'all didn't play it, y'all should ask questions. Y'all always hating on something that you, you never experienced for no reason. All because someone told you that you wouldn't be good at this 2K. So now you just hate all 2Ks. That was uh before your time. Look, see how he immediately got his shot up too? For years now, get a fade or an ugly clunky jump shot animation after separation. It's stupid. And you want to know what they do that they did that? To try to cater to the negative win percents and to lower the skill gap. Look. Every, everyone loving this clip. Look at this NPC. Apparently, we're the reason why uh, you're not going to have a KD or Wimby build or realistic gameplay because of, of talented players. We're the reason why, man. It, it's not that just they're just catering to the weak. <laughs> they're, they're just catering to the NPCs of the game. So y'all don't cry. That's the reason Patch 4 came in the game for 2K15 because y'all cry. Shooting's too hard. Look, look how fast he's driven this. Derf Two K sixteen. Why? Why did they take out speed boosting at the end? Patch six. Because y'all NPCs cried. Skilled players weren't saying take it out. They catered to the NPCs, man. They trying to pull up, pull up. Y'all got to war people. They think y'all enjoy that better, but you really won't. You're still going to complain. Whatever is the meta, y'all are complaining about it. It don't matter what they do. Everybody missed this hoe. Now, 2K Intel tweeted out my clip. He says, so this doesn't look more fun than 2K24. Let's see what everybody's saying. People saying it looks more fun. Top four, 2K. Look, people seem to like it, bro. People saying no, man. They they just don't know, man. I'm telling y'all, you could play like sick in a bag, bro. Like this is just, that's just the stage, bro. Imagine how you could play just like being a casual. I'm telling you, man. Everything was chained together, smooth. It was nice, bro. I'm telling you, bro. Niggas never know how fun 2K15 was. They never will know. No, and nobody talking about 7-3, 7 foot. We're not, I'm not talking about, I'm just talking about the dribble system, bro. And I ain't talking about bringing crossover 16 and 10. I'm just talking about the dribble system, bro. See, what is he talking about? Look, you see? People liking it. They liking it, bro. I'm telling you. People that experience 15, bro, they know, bro. Look, if, if y'all don't believe what I'm saying, you can debate it live, okay? You can hit up my Discord, debate it live. Or you can download the PC version for free, like a server. You got to join a Discord. You can download it for free, and you'll be able to dribble, and you'll see. It's a huge difference, dog. Even search up on TikTok. There's people who post old uh, 2K from the, um, their little PC version, right? And you can see how the them 2Ks really, really could be played, bro. It's immaculate. It's a true beauty. And they get tons of views. Even the guy getting cooked was having the time of his life. That's how you know the game was goaded. You want a realistic 2K. This is realism. Having the freedom to, to dribble the basketball and not having restrictions is real basketball. And this dude, NPC, says, not gonna lie, it look worse. Anything, you shouldn't be able to fade with ease at the three like it's nothing. I don't care. You couldn't in 15. Fading at the three was not a thing. It was not a thing until like 18. Like, oh, you had shot creator in 17. It was hard to fade from three. Yeah. Community would complain. Guys, everything in life is complained about. There's levels of complaints. We all complain about our woman, but there's different levels of females, bro, right? Just how big is the issue? You know, how level of complaints? Just because, say you're gonna complain no matter what, right? There could be different levels of your frustration. Why do people just try to be like, you're, you're still gonna get by? It just don't make sense, bro. Way more fun if they like it, bro. 2K24, one of the worst games I played. He's saying it looks like a kid's game. Now look, he's saying NBA Jams revamp. NPC, guys, you could shoot from full court and beyond half court in the wreck in 2K24. What is a kid's game? That's 2K24, guys. It's not 15. You couldn't do that in 15. The spam full court shots. There was no takeover or Hall of Fame badges in 15. Guys. There was no heat check, bro. 
That sounds like NBA Jam. I ain't gonna hold it. Uh, this nigga said dribble moves and didn't involve any of his other teammates. <laughs> bro, y'all don't think y'all could do that at 24? Bro, Nick <laughs> lost, bro. More fun than any 2K we've had in the last six years. Give you a like, buddy. <laughs> Most of the people hating on it, they never experienced it. Or they was like a three win percent, so they didn't know. But most people, they saying they like it, bro. I ain't gonna hold you, bro. I be trying to put y'all on. Anywho, click the video on the screen. You wanna see what a 2K insider gotta say? We break it down in depth. But hey, hey, here we go again. Yeah. Here, here we go again. People talking this for witness. Hit the fan. Everything I'm that made me. Now break it down. Yo, off the top of the dome. dome.